I'm here today in the Shard building on a floor that is uh, the home of Warwick Business School, part of uh, the University of Warwick. I'm here with Greg Clark, the ex-Secretary of State for Business and now the Executive Chair of Innovation at the University of Warwick. We've heard today about the uh, launch of STEM Connect and of course the building that goes with it. How important is this? I think it's important to the university, I think it's important to Coventry and Warwickshire, but I think it's important to the country uh, as well. The university has always been very applied to the real world, you know, whether it's supporting and attracting JLR, all of the different industries uh, in the area. And what's happening is that you know, as the technologies converge, this initiative, this building, is bringing together all of the different disciplines uh, so that it can be a springboard in the future for investment and the creation of jobs. And clearly, as, as, as the economy changes and the industrial strategy helps to inform that and we move towards a green industrial strategy, if I can say yeah. that, clearly this, this research and this work going on here will absolutely help to inform that and actually bring investment and prosperity to the region as well? Absolutely. The, the timing, I think, is brilliant. The government has just published its green paper on the yeah. industrial strategy and virtually every one of the, the target sectors, clean energy, you know, looking at uh, data and tech, uh, right across the board, is part of what's been done in the University of Warwick and is going to be done in this new centre. So it really positions, I think, University of Warwick and therefore Coventry and Warwickshire uh, at the at the front of the pack of the whole country when it comes to implementing the industrial strategy. Thank you, Greg. That's Great. a really powerful, powerful message. Coventry and Warwickshire at the heart of what is going to be the industrial strategy, the green industrial strategy going forward that can inform our economy, create jobs, bring investment to our region.